sasa Daisy amesema morning baby eh uh, your man akasema morning to hani niko poa nimekuuliza huyo ni nani si nikuuliza si had asked hebu endelea hebu endelea kai steve daisy akauliza hizi ni chat za while a while back aka akauliza mechi leo ukamwambia god ukamwambia hajarudi bado hebu kidogo ukamwambia hajarudi bado unaweza uka come through because niko makutu mbaya akakwambia hello angel some angel wanjiko and i'm here with my producer collins angels to go on road to a million subscribers to endele ko subscribe so that we can get there and of course welcome back to the reunion show tunajua what goes down here mambo ni live live kwa ground and of course angels mnaniona i'm still here with our people of the day niko na niko na Steve hapa na ako na warembo wake wawili ambao haukuko unajua she's going to be here that is Bri you guys have been together for one year now mmekuwa mkidate mmekuwa mkiishi hadi pamoja and then of course here we also have another lady mwenye mmekuwa pamoja for three months na uliamua kumleta picnic sindo yeah. ukamleta picnic juu ulikuwa nafikiria ako na some shady things anafanya with someone else jo alikwambia hana mtu mwingine but now tume find out hata hawakuwa wame break up mm-hmm. so we want to talk about your relationship na yaya hata hamkutuambia mlipatana wapi mkakatiana aje ndo mkaanza ku date ulipatana wapi na yaya oh tulipatana na yaya movie night ya red cross eh. yeah. movie night ya red cross eh. uh-huh ilikuwa imehostiwa sasa tukae tulikuwa tumeenda huko kuwa fun so ndio nikaenda kamsporti kajituma eh yeah. kamsporti kazi yako ni kusport watu kwa shows si ndio uh-huh. si ndio steve so pia huyu ule msport kwa show ukajituma eh yeah. yeah. so wewe wenye alikuku alikuwa approach what was the conversation that you guys had aliniambia like ana tafuta i'm saying na jumi nilikuwa single and mm. nili like vibe yake si nikaenda na flow yani juu mm. yeah juu nilikuwa like ready to be in a relationship Goza. so ali ulisema ati uko single Goza. nielewe hapa uh-huh. mimi nilimu approach nilikuwa peke yangu okay kwa hiyo movie night uh-huh. na unajua kwa movie night uwezi uh-huh. uwezi enda ku watch movie solo uh-huh. sasa so, mimi nilikuwa naenda na intention ya tuna watch movie night peke then after there so, nivo so you approached her in that event because you wanted you guys to sit together and watch movie eh. that's what you wanted eh. eh. na niruka saa hii eh. saa na niruka alikuitisha namba story uh-huh. alinitisha namba uh-huh. kwanza okay. sasa ku, kuongea ndio alikuwa ananiambia oh niko single sijui nini uh-huh. akaniuliza kana niko single nikamwambia ya na niko ready sijui nini nini yani story ka flow tu na akaniambia sema ukuya na danganya huyo ni relationship okay yeah na danganya So Una... wewe because you cannot be in a relationship with someone mwenye hataki kuko in a relationship that means kama mm-hmm. anafikiria wewe ni chali yake ulimwambia unataka kuwa chali yake ah mimi mimi nilimwambia nilimuuliza kama kuna mtu cha next akasema hapana nikasema acha nikae hapo sasa ile conversation ikaanza mi intention yangu ilikuwa movie night peke so after there ndio sasa si unajua ukipata new friends unachukua namba sasa mimi kuchukua eh. namba kwenda kuongea ongea naye kidogo eh dema shajipa so, akaniambia hadi eh asha ni crashia so yeye ndo alikwambia ni crashia si ndio ili happen mbona why you lying mbona unadanganya by the way nataka ukweli so yeye ndo alikukrashia wewe haukumkatia mimi nilienda ina friend ni maana lakini ye after sasa wanda nitoa chat saa hii by the way aliniambia ako single na akaniuliza nikamshow kama you ready 
ni sawa so sasa mkakuwa in a relationship because you didn't have someone so yeah, yeah yeah na aka how kuniambia kaka kona mtu vile okay. anasema sai mm. yeah so how soon after that ndo mlianza kuvisitiana okay after like two weeks okay mm. ulienda kwake ama yeye alikuja kwenu okay the first meet up yenye tuli tulienda nje like in public mm. but then the ile ya kupatana kabisa nilienda kwake mm. yeah and were you guys intimate Mm-mm. No. You're the first time you did not do anything. No, 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 yeah. But after time went on, mm, okay. it happened. Steve. Steve. You are intimate with another person, another girl. Surely Steve, you don't okay. cheat. Steve, you never you don't cheat, Steve. Steve. I don't. You don't and that what's this I'm hearing in is in a skia Steve. What are these? Mimi alikuja kunikatia mimi. Alikuja akaniambia ameni kerashia. Oh my god. So when you come we crash ya goja alikuja akakwambia amekukrasha ukaamua kulala na yeye ah unaona dio first time yake hmm. aliniuliza hmm. ama anaweza hmm. kama nakaa peke yangu hmm. akuje sleep over okay. so, mimi sasa ikabidi kwa my man sleep over yako ikamwambia nikamwambia niko peke yangu huyu hmm. alikuwa kwao hmm. alikuwa huko kwa nyumba yako anadanganya just because we are hapa okay. who are you so, lying naonge ukweli Sijui tutoe chat ama tufanye nini juu I still have them. Yeah. I want yeah. proof. Yeah. So because let's just talk kidogo kwanza. Mm-hmm. So yeye yeah, anasema wewe uli, uli request uende sleep over kwake. Hey Jesus Christ. Imagine anadanganya. Mm-hmm. Wow, una feel Yendo kama huyo alijiforce kwa kwa your man? Of course. Mm-hmm. Yeye ndo alijiforce. What do these How people do? do? do kwanza by the book kwanza nyamaza usionge. Mara kidogo. He's my man. Excuse me. So sasa sawa ukaenda siku ya kwanza siku ya pili mkaanza kukua in a intimate relationships muli establish wewe ni boyfriend na girlfriend ama mlikuwa tu mna go along with the situation. Yeye ndo alikuja akaniambia I want you to be my girlfriend. Mimi siwezi jituma ati nianze ku divorce kwa mtu ama nianze kunini kitu yenye haiko. Una get? Yeah. So wewe ulimwambia unataka kukua chali yake? Ah. Aliniuliza. Alikusa yeye amekuja kwangu akaniuliza yeye na kweni uko peke yako hmm. kweni una mtu wewe by the way ongea ukweli wewe ongea ukweli ndio lijiforce mimi nikamwambia mimi nakaa peke yangu uh-huh. akaniambia uh-huh. si we can be lovers so yeye ndiye alisuggest mko lovers with my yeah. man yeah. 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 with my man excuse me with my man wewe na usiniguze ni unaongea mani mimi naongea pia mimi i have a say here he's my man so let us at your lover let us ask your man uyu penye alikuja sleep over ilikuwa kwa nyumba yenu ama ilikuwa kwa nyumba yako kwanza hiyo ndo nataka kujua hiyo sana sana mleta kwetu juu ya nguo zake So ulimpeleka wapi? 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 Tulikuwa kwa bro yangu. Oh, ulimpeleka kwa bro yangu. Kwenye sasa tulikuwa tunaishi na bro na na huyo bro yangu. Okay. Sasa wewe alikwambia ni kwake. Aliniambia ni kwake by the way. You didn't know he was living with his family? No. Mimi nilijua huyu ni a single man, hivyo vile yako hana dem, hana No. So wewe kwa kwa ulikuwa na hope relationship yenu itaenda aje? Mimi nilikuwa na niliona like He's a nice person. Mimi niliona like ni mzuri okay. from the start. Yes. Lakini hizi tabia zake za kujifanya like hmm. Sasa yeye ame alisema anafanya kazi and she's also working. Wewe pia unafanya kazi? Yeah, mimi nafanya kazi. Hmm. Lakini huyu hakuniambia anafanya kazi. Hmm. Sijui aliniambia anafanya ngaizi ma sijui ma whatever. Uliniambia zinaitwa jizi ma vitu za Excuse me. Yeah, excuse me. Mm-hmm. Ma hizo ma vitu zenye anafanyanga. Mm. So yeah. alikwambia ana kazi. Eh. Yeah. Okay. Mm. So wewe relationship yenu ulikuwa na hope muta muta tutaendelea vizuri. Eh. Yeah. Because b- before upatane na yeye, relationship yako ya mwisho mlikuwa mmekaa kwa muda gani? Nilikuwa nimeka for like two years. Okay. Yeah. So why did you break up? Nili break up na huyo mzee mm-hmm. juu ali cheat on me. Okay. Mm. So ukajipatia space and then you found someone yeah. mm. and you trusted him I outright. Trusted him. Huh. Mhm. Kutoka kwake akuje aribu yangu. No, I hata siko anajua kama by the way mbona uongei? Juni uli nikatia. Si uli si uli niambia umenikrashia. Alafu. Unajua say it is a toy if simu to some chat from day one. I want proof. Ah, unajua kuliendaje? Mm-hmm. Si unajua ulikuwa home. Mimi hata usiniangalie. Huyo alikuwa home. Mm-hmm. So nilikuwa nilikuwa alone. Wewe okay. ni muongo. Kaja tusikie. Sasa nikiwa alone mm. aka ikakuwa kama ni coincident. Tukapatana. Okay. Adi akaniambia atakuja. Aka akaniambia hata atakuja sleep over. 
alafu saa hiyo like tumeka two months before sasa tupatane mm. atujaongea tujapatana hakuna nini mm. sasa si unaona mm-hmm. ikabidi sasa nimemwambia tu kuja na mimi nikajua stampeleka kwangu. So why uli uli kwa intimate na yaya to that level because you are not talking to your girl? Yeah, alafu atukua tumeka na yeye. Tukua tumepatana sana. Uh. Yeah. So kwa nini hamkukua mnaongea? Okay, tulikuwa tunaongea sometimes uh-huh. but atukua like ile ku meet. Uh-huh. Atukua tuna meet. Uh-huh. Eh jua yeye Okay. Yeah. And you wanted someone who was supposed who was going to be there with you? Yeah. Uh, so even like Godja, Godja, and that's why that's why you into the picture because you needed someone who was going to be there with you yes after uh, me so after me sema maneno ya ya sleepover uh-huh. akakuja uh-huh. so bibi ulikuwa ikakuwa serious so sleepover ndo ilifanya mkuwe serious with each ni replace you dem for the time being do arudi udizireta communication is a problem here wao ulisema mlianza kukuwa na issues na communications pia si ndio ni nini ili happen ndo mkaacha kuongea na wao ulikuwa huku na yeye alikuwa huku huyu mse kitu ya kwanza i came to notice he's rude si unasikia hata sasa hivi anaongea hapa si unasikia dia ananitusi mimi na ati anasema mimi ni demu yake ananitusi kitu ya kwanza namuongelesha ananiongelesha vile anataka kitu ya pili he is not caring so did you talk to him about that issue ya yeye kukuwa rude yeah ni ni shame waambia akaniambia oh i'm going to change sijui ni nini sijui ke lakini he never changed so kwa nini wewe ulikuwa unamuongelesha vibaya na ni mtu mwenye unakatia unataka kukuwa na yeye ama you didn't value her mimi sikuwa namuongelesha vibaya alafu tena mi like Siku ya serious. Hauko mm. serious na. Hauko serious mimi ulikuwa unanitumia tu hivyo. Just like that. Ah, ah unajua? Ni mm-hmm. si una si si ni uli dileta. Gari usijaribu kunijileta hizo mas. Si ni uli dileta. Mimi nikajileta na wewe ndio uli. Ni uli ni uli kuja maneno ya uko ukaanza maneno yangu. So sasa hiyo unadigeuka saa hii. Unadigeuka. Ugeuke ni kweli. Na unajitungia story hapa saa hii ya uongo. He's a liar. Okay. And Stories like Has he ever lied to you again before? Of course, huyu ni muongo kabisa. Okay. Mhm. So wewe uh, kwa nini ulikuwa unakuwa na yeye na unajua ako rude na ako uncaring? Hiyo duration yenye tu kwa tunaongea. I was trying to like kufikiria mm. niendelee na huyu msia mani mm. niachane tu na yeye. Okay. So ni nini ndio ilifanya hata imenye nilikuwa mgonjwa mm. hakutaka kujua ni nini shida yangu. Okay, na... He was not there for me. Mm. Yeah. Na sasa wewe hata tumekuja hapa kwa hii vacation kwa hii picnic and you did not even try to ask her babe shida ilikuwa wapi? Juu nikimuuliza huh? haongeangi. Okay. Nikimu kuna hiyo time nilimuulizanga mm-hmm. ama kuna kuna venye naweza help akaniambia ngoja nikamwambia basi si ukuje kwangu so tukaange tukaange na wewe uh-huh. at least tukiwa karibu uh-huh. nitaweza kutekea of you so wewe mlikuwa pamoja so mlikuwa pamoja mimi nataka tu jibu mlikuwa pamoja na ni nini hizi unasema unasikia dia jelewi kajelewi kwa nini wewe you are not able to open up to him unaweza ukamwambia nini ndio ilikuwa shida ni obviously nilishamwambia jana mm-hmm. before tukuje mm-hmm. but before that mm-hmm. the reason as well sikuwa nime show ni juu hakuwa hakuwa interested kujua unajua kuna ile like una, unaona mse wako haongei mm-hmm. ama ako na shida unataka kujua so what was the problem nili nilikuwa na ugonjwa fulani mm-hmm. uti nilikuwa na uti yeah okay. and i was not ready to share with him mm-hmm. ile like evil fast uh-huh. unaona okay. so that's why nilikuwa like na chill na jipea ile mm-hmm. yeah Ivo fast yeah. mwezi mzima mm. mwezi mzima hezi ni ambia Ungeenda kujua hata ungekuja home utake kujua what's happening Unasikia hadi magonjwa zinasemwa Steve unasikia Unasikia aji. magonjwa unasikia Ngoja So wewe unaona kama yeye ameenda kuchukua huko magonjwa akulete What else hmm. What else Oh no. si hivyo What else Steve mimi nilete magonjwa mimi ah. Steve ah. na wewe mimi niko loyal Huyu ah. mse ni muongo kitu ya kwanza Kwanza wewe niulize aje Uwezi enda kwa mtu kama mjapanga si ndio? Mm-hmm. Juu si si hadi. You don't have to ask for permission kukuja kuniona. Ah, 
time nikikuja kwenu nilikuwa kwanza na, na kupigia na kuuliza ama nikuje tulikuwa hizo tulikuwa niko home kwa hao wenye ulienda ushaipatana na mtu wao yoyote ah, most of the time nilikuwa napata brother yake pekee okay eh. so ujaipatana na wazazi wake or anything na wajua lakini sijai wapata huko okay eh. Na wewe mlisema nyinyi mnajuana kwenu. Anajulikana kwenu unajulikana kwao. Anajulikana. Uh-huh. Anajua kila mtu. Anajua ni mwongo and he was cheating on you. Wewe homebreaka nyamaza. Ndio siliongelesha vibaya sister. Ndio ngelesha Ah ngoja. Ngoja. Wewe msimsirushane kwa. Ngoja. 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 Si ungesema ulikuwa unataka petit. Ulikuwa unataka petit. Eh? Sungachana na mimi. Maneno gani? Wendo huko. So nikuulize wewe Steve because your girlfriend here always kwa tuko hapa tunaongea kuhusu mtu mwingine na we expect a quick calm, si ndio? You guys were in a relationship. Ukienda kukatia huyu, did you tell her mume break up? Ah, tuko tume break up. So ham kuko ame break up, break up at all at all. Mimi sijui mbona alianza ku behave hivyo. So yeye yeah, anasema alikuwa acha ushago akakuja huko and he was lonely. Kwani ham kuko mna communicate or anything? Tulikuwa tuna communicate. Uh-huh. But sasa mimi sijui what happened honestly. Yes, as ingine unajua uko ushago network and everything. Uh-huh. Na lazima ningekaa huko because uh-huh. of what I was going through. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. But I didn't know this is what he was doing Steve. Mm-hmm. Unajua nini? Mimi nilidhani mm-hmm. amenyamazia. Juu mm-hmm. ame ali uh-huh. alinyamaza na piga simu. Uh-huh. Ikomteja. Sasa yeye amechukua anasema hedo unakaaka unasikia kuna mtu anaongea. Kwa kwetu kunanga network. Si kwa nusu ushai kuja kidhunguri. Kidhunguri hakunanga network. Mimi nirudi nikadhani ni atia shapa ta mtu mwingine. Steve unaweza nifikiria hivyo? Huyu amejileta nikasema nikatumikiwa chance. Gaja wewe ulifikiria demu yako amepata mtu mwingine na mnaishi kwa nyumba moja. Si mlikuwa mnaishi kwa nyumba moja huku. Eh lakini hakuwa karibu. Unanifikiria hivyo kwa nini? Mbona unanifikiria hivyo? Mimi unanibebaze. Ai. Bro. So kwa nini ufikiria kwa na mtu mwingine ama because you you had someone else? Ah unajua after ameninyamazia. Hadi mtu akikunyamazia. Kuna vitu utaanza kujijazia. Okay. Sasa mimi nikaanza kujijazia nikasema eh hapa nimenyamaziwa. Hmm. Alafu nisha nishapatwa ni, ni na mwingine. Umepatwa na mwingine, umepatwa na mwingine. Hiyo ndio kazi yako, si ndio Steve? Uh, Wewe relationship yenu because hebu kidogo mmekuwa pamoja for one year, si ndio? Yeah. Mmekuwa pamoja for one year. Yeah. Relationship yenu obviously ilikuwa na ups and downs, right? Yeah. So did you ever get into a situation where your man unampata na msichana mwingine wako huko nje wa mechit? Uliaisikia hizo story kumuhusu? I have never uh-huh. since we started dating with Steve. Mimi sijawaisikia kitu kama hiyo. Uh-huh. Let me tell you. Uh-huh. Basasa sasa venye alianza hizi after I went ndio nilishindwa what's happening. Okay. Of course uh-huh. hata wewe ushago kuna ushago wa kunanga net. Uh-huh. Unaona? Sasa mimi nikajiambia surely anafaa kuelewa. Mm. So na wewe because ulika uko for so long ulikuwa ulikuwa unatarajia utarudi umpate tu ako kwa nyumba anaendelea na shughuli zake anakuelewa whatever is happening to you. Exactly. Okay. Jupia yeye amekuwa na ups and downs zake. Kuna time hadi alikuwa ameenda job akakaa for like one and a half months. And akanipata nilikuwa tu namngoja. Okay. Sunaona? So it is something that is normal in your relationship. Ya kwa kwa juu kazi yangu mm. naweza pata niko nimeitoa contract like nimeambiwa niende Mombasa mm. na hatuwezi enda naye yeah. juu kuna wenye tunaenda nao wenye tunafanya kazi mm-hmm. so si mm. lakini sasa hii yake ya kwenda ushago mm. ameenda ame, mimi nikienda nikienda mimi mpigia simu kila siku so wao mna communicate when you are yeah. away eh, kila Kuko siku na network Kwaje nilikuwa kukuwa na network. Ulikuwa unataka nifanye hadi charge hakuna, hadi stima hakuna. So ulikuwa mnaongea after a several days. Exactly. Nenda na, nenda mpaka town, town ya Ushago, mm-hmm. natafuta stima naomba charge na lipa, mm-hmm. ndio nionge tu na yeye. By the way, mimi atasikuwa na story na mtu mwingine. And for you, why did it take you that long before urudi tena huku? Because I understand ulikuwa umeenda mazishi. Exactly. Nilikuwa nimeenda mazishi. Mm-hmm. No joy, I'm not the only one who lost. Pia kuna wenye walikuwa wame lose and I had to be there. Lazima tungekuwa there for each other. Okay. Sunaona? Sasa 
mbona anifanyie hivi hadi mm. hakukuja alikuja tu siku ya mazishi hakukuja siku zingine hadi siku zenye alikuwa off si unakuanga off from friday to sunday mbona hukukuja ulikuwa tu huku huku nje we we ni uli ni back ni jinga nta ku point achana na yaya so ulikuwa na expect akuja kukonsole akae na wewe huko kama hayuko kazi of course hata kama si si, si weekend zote mm. angekuja tu once and ulize by the mbona si sipati as in sikupati nikukukol haingi na sasa swali yangu ni sio ulikuwa na kazi huku What, what happened what happened to your job because i understand mtu akienda for like a whole month unaweza kuvutwa kazi ama 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 ulikuwa umeomba permission ya the whole month nilikuwa nimeomba permission yes uh-huh. but nilikuwa nimeomba ya 14 days okay. so the rest of the days nilishindwa kukuja kwa sababu unaona alikuwa ashaanza kuni ghost so i was like okay hata kama narudi bado i have this pain inside of me si jamaliza hakuna za niende job na mind yangu haiko kwa job i'm not going to work effectively na hapo bondo walikuvuta kazi walinivuta hapo hivyo they called me nikapata wame ni call i had to call them back wakaniambia sorry tumekuvuta kazi mm-hmm. but all in all i know i have the qualifications i can get another job mm-hmm. so hiyo haikuwa shida kwangu mm-hmm. of course and i also i know my dad can support me anaweza niekea job na mimi nilikuwa tu natafuta a man mmoja anaweza tu nipenda i didn't care about the financial status of the love of my life yeah. na hivi ndivyo unanifanyia ni huyu kubali tu unaona sasa huyu ndiye huyu huyu ndiye amenileta shida zote always you can ignore whatever she saying she, she ameongea na amesema from the bottom of her heart how she is feeling i feel like it is only right for you to take it with the same way it okay unaelewa kenya anasema eh yeah, naelewa mm. wazazi wazazi wako familia yenu inamtambua kabisa mm. how do they take him as your guy they respect him uh-huh. they take him as a cool guy an understanding guy uh-huh. na wakasema he's fit for me okay sasa vitu nasikia hadi wakieza sikia mimi hadi sijui this is uh-huh. so much shame because they are probably going to watch this video wewe familia yao what do you think they will think of you wakijua ulipata msichana mwingine na uko na mtoto wao guy ni nini guy ni nini zote huyu ndiye amenileta hizi shida zote Sulikuwa na mkana before. Ulikuwa unasema umjui na ni ex. Sasa jionge tu sikini. Lakini si umeleta hizi shida zote. Kwani yeye hana kichwa mzuri kujua. Hadi wewe una kichwa mzuri wewe. Unatoka huko nje unaacha unakuja for my man. Why? Because of what? Hebu nyamaza kwanza juu staki staki mabishano na wewe. Mimi si nyamazi. Mimi kitu ya kwanza najua wewe ni ex. Hawezi nitoa hapo. Who's ex are you? And you who are you? Mm. Eh? Just a whole aliokota from somewhere and then akakuja. Mm-hmm because i was Ali not there yangu. excuse me yes hajawahi niacha hakuna kuachana tulikuwa tumeachana na sister before tukuje hapa leo before i called you before ni kueleze whatever is happening in your man's life wewe haukukuwa na idea ako na mtu mwingine sendo Vanya ulirudi kutoka ushago. Haukumwangalia hivi ukamsuspect ukaona kama he is unfaithful to you ama kama ako na fishy business going on. How would I have known na he was not coming? He was not coming. Okay. We were not talking. Okay. He ghosted me. His brother was not talking to me. How would I have known? Sunaona mimi singejua. Sasa nikashindwa mara na nifanyia hivi. So wewe kwa nini ulikata uliacha kumuongelesha kabisa kabisa? Is it that ulimwacha ukaendea huyu? Is it that you don't love her? Is it that you don't respect your relationship? Ama what is going on? Okay, unajua after after huyu amekuja, mm. after ameniambia hiyo maneno. Mm. Nikaona sasa huyu na yeye atuongei sana. Hiyo kama hiyo attention ni kama inaisha. Sasa nimekuwa huyu na yeye, si ndio? Ah, nimekuwa si huyu na yeye. Ah, mimi usinishike. Babe. Don't touch me. Na yeye nyamaza kwanza tusikie. Hebu hebu useme chenye unasema saa hii. Ongelesha. Sasa. Mimi nikaona huyu ni kama ako na mtu. Nikaona sasa acha nikae kae na huyu. So wait, ukaona ukae kae na huyu? Eh. Yeah. So 
mimi nilikuwa hapo tu for the time being. Nilijileta. Nilijileta. Sawa, ngoja. So, hebu kidogo. Hebu kidogo. Uliamuka ikae na huyu. Did you develop feelings for Lena? Do you love her? No. What do you feel for her? He doesn't love you. He doesn't love you. It's clear. He doesn't. Sasa yeye kama kunita beb. Akupendi. Tulia. Siongeza hii nataka kujua. Haupendwi, haupendwi. Tulia nini wewe? Acha acha ajibu, acha ajibu ya mwenyewe. Una What do you feel for Lena? What do you feel for her because mlikuja picnic pamoja? Huyu. Ameni kitu ya kwanza ameniharibia siku. Aha. Adinikatia. Ulikuwa unanipenda peke yako. Oh. Eh. Yeah. Ulikuwa unanipenda peke yako, umejua sasa? Mimi nyingine. Sasa hivi kitu kingine ni atistaki kukuona. Unaona viki tu umenifanyia leo? You deserve it. Hii yote ndio una deserve. Ujue we ni muongo na wewe ujue ulitumiwa na wewe ujue we ni ex na hakutambui anasema hivyo saa hii saa hii ndo anasema hivyo before that alikuwa anaongea trash about you alikuwa anaongea trash kuhusu ex wake alisema vitu kama nini alikuwa anasema huyu ati hata hako anampenda hampendi mimi ndo anatambua sasa yeye anageuza story anageuza wewe unaziambia And I give the story just because of that. Ju I've been asking him about this lady. Na amekuwa kiniambia there's nothing. Waliachana hata hata kistori zake. Na wewe? Ngoja, ngoja, ngoja niulize Lena something. Let me ask Lena something. Uliniambia alikupatia reason ya yeye ku break up na mpenzi wake. I'm sure uh, uh, ulisema alikupatia a different reason than the one that is here right now because we understand we alikuwa usha go. Na that's why hawakuwa wana communicate wakaachana. Wewe alikuambia kwa nini waliachana? Aliniambia alipata Bree na another guy. Okay. Na alipata pia uh -huh. mahali like alinyesha hadi picha. Uh -huh. Ati aliwaona place na, na boy fulani. Uh -huh. And yeah, even if walisema uliniambia ulipata Bree wapi Steve na boy mwingine? Na alimpiga picha hivi. Ukaambiwa na nani? Wewe alipata Bree na mtu mwingine? Yes. Lakini because it's like he's not yes he man enough kuenda ku, ku fight for this lady. Lakini wewe hapa sasa hii unajifanya wewe ndo kila kitu. When kila kitu just know you mean nothing. You also mean nothing my dear. Let me tell you. And he has evidently said it with his mouth. Bria butu uliza bwana yako wewe Steve kwa nini uli uliambia Lena you found your your girlfriend with another man and that's why you broke up. Mimi sikumwambia maneno ya Bri. Uh. Adi ni udiza nikawa nikanyamaza. Uh. Eh. Yeah. So sadi so, hiyo maneno ya Peter haiku ya Bri. Uh. Eh. Yeah. Haiku kwa haiku kwa Bri na mtu mwingine. Ni story ni tulikuwa najitengenezea mimi. So ulikuwa unajitengenezea nini? Hata unadanganya na jina yako le. Wewe unafaa kupewa adabu wewe. Na adabu wewe mimi nitakupiga wala mimi nitakupiga. Ngoja. Nifanyia kitu kama hiyo walai. Akishuko what's this? Wewe niondoke na usili point. Kama what's this? Kubali. nini? Kubali bro. Kubali nini? You are cheater. Wewe ni nyamazia. Sasa hebu tukuje hapa pamoja because sasa clearly wewe umekuwa ume, umekuwa alaya. These two ladies mm, hamjuani, si ndio? The reason why ngoja songa hivi. The reason why Lena you contacted me it's because you told me you love this man yeah, you and you want to know what is happening mm -hmm. na yeye, yeah. si ndio? Yeah. That's why tulikuja hapa. Si ndio? Yeah. So yeah. sasa kuko na another lady here mwenye I understand unampenda pia, si ndio? Sasa yeah. huko unajua something that is happening na another woman. Exactly. So because you guys are here wewe una, una, uh, unataka kukuwa na huyu kijana unataka waachane na demu yake ama what are you thinking right mimi nataka saa hii ajiongee aseme mm. this is what i want nataka kubaki na huyu nataka hivi na hivi mm. juu i've been asking him mm -hmm. juu si mara ya kwanza nimeona story na bri mm. so ye mwenye ndo anafaa niambie mm. bila so, nataka na bado una force unajua na exist mm -hmm. unajua niko madam Ex excuse me mm -hmm. Na wewe, do you want your man back ama unataka achague kati yenu nyinyi wawili? Mimi nataka ukweli. Okay. Steve mimi namjua. Mm -hmm. Steve is a nice guy, ni kichwa ngumu inawe, but mimi nataka aseme tu ukweli 
hizo vitu dem anasema nione kama ni kweli mimi hapo sasa nikishaona everything na by sight mm. hapo nipo nitaamini so right now are you feeling like he has betrayed you and he your has trust he betrayed me i mm. feel so bad mm. surely steve after everything na mleta kwangu na mpeleka kwetu na kwa nini ulimleta kwako hamngeta after nyumba ingine mu move in pamoja what was the need i had everything okay. i loved him hmm. and he claimed he loved me too so kulikuwa na adza gani bune muuleza wewe una feel aje when she told you unaweza kaenda kwake and she's going to do everything mimi nampenda hmm. na ndio maana nikakubali hmm. hadi kuenda kukaa na yeye so wewe uh, uko feel like ina toy your masculinity away from you kwenda kukaa kwa nyumba ya dem ah uh-uh. You are okay with that? Yeah, jo mm. tunapendana. Okay. Yeah. So kwa hii relationship yenu apart from hiyo issue ya wewe kuenda home juzi, kuna mambo zingine zenye mmekoa mkipitia? Hiyo mwaka yenye mmekoa pamoja. Things are there ups and downs. Mm-hmm. But today mpata ameni cheat na mtu, mm-hmm. ni zile tu issues za umeenda wapi? Maybe ujaniambia umeenda mm. ama maybe kuna kitu umefanya ujaniambia ama nini una go through na uniambi. So, no, kuna time sana tokanga na semi penye ameenda. I trust anaenda job mm. na kama ajaenda job ako kwa brother yake. Mm. Unless brother yake wana mkavaria I don't know because hata brother yake juzi when I was calling him alikuwa ananiambia I had bad things about you. Mm-hmm. Na shindo bad things like what? So, I'm trying to reach him. What's happening? Why why were you talking trash talking your girlfriend to your family? Okay, see me niliongea. Ni nani? zilikuwa message hmm. na ni huyu ndiye aliandika. Na simu yangu. Wait a minute. Umesikia alikuwa na simu yangu. Goza. Goza. My guy. Si umesikia si umesikia hiyo siku alikuwa na simu yangu. Okay. Hiyo siku alikuwa na simu yangu. Aka sijui hadi si si peke yake. Hadi anko yangu hadi niuliza. Ai Kweni nani yako na nimepiga simu haijachukudiwa. Alafu sasa kidogo kidogo uh-huh. ndio bro ananiambia eh hizi ma message naona ni za nini. So yeye ndo ali text uh, yeah. wa, wa, familia yako yeah. akitumia simu yako akitrash talk your girlfriend. Eh. Yeah. Sasa so, mbona ukwambia brother yako ni yeye? Mbona nadanganya his lie. His lie you did not you did not talk to his brother ukaongea mm-hmm. vibaya kuhusu huyu. Mm-hmm. Nuli andika message. Mm-hmm. Alisema ngoja. Alisema vitu kama nini tuanze hapo. Juu hiyo siku mm-hmm. mi, mi sikuambiwa. Mm-hmm. Maybe kama huyo aliambiwa atuambie. Juu okay. mimi mi kuzo yangu huyo bro yangu aliniambia mm-hmm. kuna ma message ameona. Mm-hmm. Eh sinaongea vibaya. Mm-hmm. Nikamuuliza nikamuuliza nani? Kuhusu wewe babe. Alafu sasa mbona ukumwambia si wewe ulimtumia? Mimi nilimwambia si mimi. Ni picha kwa familia yako. Mimi mimi nimetuma. So, Akaniambia hebu uh, atajua ata, ataona niazi. Bri wewe uliambiwa aje na familia yao? Walikwambia ni nini umefanya? Mimi niliambiwa tu na brother yake. Mm. Ati nime ati aliniona nikihanga utu kwa ushago na watu wa ushago. Juu nilikuwa huko. Nikamuuliza shuali. Mm. What's that? Mm. Alafu mimi niko na swali moja Steve. Hata mm. kama ni ude maliandika hizo messages. Mm. Alijua aje niko ushago. Mimi mm. nilikuwa nimemwambia. Mimi nilimwambia. Ulikuwa si ulikuwa mwambia mimi yeye. Ulikuwa ananiuliza. Ah, sikumwambia yeye. You even called. Sikumwambia yeye maneno ya X. Mimi Steve unanidanganya mimi. Yaani unanibebanga ufala. Sikumwambia maneno ya X. Hebu niachilie mimi usinishike. Sikumwambia. Uli aliniuliza kwa wapi? Aliniuliza huyu huyu bria ako wapi sasa hivi? Mimi nikamwambia nikamwambia ako ushago. Eh. Anadanganya. huyu kuku ushago sijui what. So okay, sasa let me ask you bri. I want proof. So what do you suggest we do? I suggest we check. Tuangalie simu yake because mimi sielewi how can this guy do this to me? Uko na simu yako? Tusaidie na simu yako please. Na unatupea tu immediately lakini iko na password tutole. Wewe haufichi vitu zozote kwa simu sinda? Uh-huh. Leo ni leo tunajua leo. Mm-hmm. Today is today. So uh, wewe kwani uh, how how trust size? I understand. How can right? I trust him? Mm. Because what's all this? 
even trash talking and everything he's lying huo ndio uliandika mbaya sana wewe sasa sasa ndio ndio aka huko sasa coca cola logs tusikilizane kidogo wewe amekusave aje alikuwa amenisave babe sasa hivi kama babe na wewe amekusave aje mimi amelikuwa amenisave lifeline lifeline eh unless ali change of which na jua no okay Lifeline bado iko hapa in ndo namba yako. Eh, yeah. okay. Lifeline bado iko hapo. Naona hapa manamba hazijaseviwa. Nani yao? Naona BFF na Malave emoji. BFF Ayu. ni nani? Si ndio huyo hapa. Undo BFF. Dusha kwa BFF. Wow. Wewe ni BFF. Goja, goja. Ini namba yako hebu niambie kama ini namba yako BFF. Na love emoji. Ni namba yako? Yeah. So wendo BFF, wendo so BFF. BFF. Mm. When BFF. Ju huyo alirudi juzi nikakuwa BFF. This guy. Aya, kuna Mi anastaki kuona my savings, mm-hmm. nataka kuona charts, nataka kuona everything hivi okay. na macho. Yeah. Leo ni leo. Ni leo. Kuna ni kuna leo. namba nyingine hapa anaitwa Daisy. Daisy ni nani? Best yangu. Mm-hmm. Best yako? Guy yeah. ni nini? Best yangu. Acha tuone. Leo ni leo I tell you. Daisy ni best yangu. Wacha tuone. Yamaza, wacha tuone. Mhm. Ah, si si bado ni best yako. Si ni ule best yako fulani. Oh, Daisy ni best yako. Sijakata ni best yangu lakini nataka kuona nini hizo wanaambiana na best yangu. Unaambiana nini na best yangu? Haya, naona hapa hivi lifeline amepiniwa ambaye ni wewe, si ndio? Eh, hiyo ni DP yangu. Okay. ningia kwa BFF kidogo Nikiingia kwa BFF chats ziko clear hakuna anything ame delete kila kitu zote Are you serious hadi za leo asubuhi sasa sijui because oh. hakuna chats ka kwa Umedelit. BFF na yaya ulipeleka wapi hizo chats Goja, si usemi ukulisa hii. Si nuli dileta kwa maisha yangu. Nini unashinda ukileta shida? Chat hadi za leo. I want to Ebu, Ebu Daisy, Ebu enda kwa Daisy. Wacha tuone huyo Daisy. Ju huyo Daisy ndo walikuwa wamepata na juzi. Haya, haya. Acha tuende kwa Daisy. Umesema unajua Daisy? Daisy ni best yangu sana. Okay. Umejoana for how long? Tumejoana for over 5 years kwa tunasoma naye high school, tukaenda okay. college moja, mm. but mimi nashtuka nini wanaambiana. Sasa Daisy amesema morning baby. Eh uh, your man akasema morning to honey niko poa. Nimekuuliza huyo ni nani? Nimekuuliza. Si head asked. Hebu endelea. Hebu endelea. Kai Steve. Daisy akauliza hizi ni chats za a while back akauliza karibia hapa karibia hapo usongi Daisy anakuambia Daisy anakuambia Bri alirudi ama anaweza nikakuja mechi leo <laughs> Ukamwambia God Steve Ukamwambia hajarudi bado hebu kidogo Steve Ukamwambia hajarudi bado unaweza uka come through because niko makutu mbaya Akakuambia I was there na mimi niko bro Wao wao ulikuwa wao hebu tusikilizane story za huyo dem hebu tusikilizane kidogo please when was that ilikuwa line hapo tusikilizane kidogo ni before bria rudi nairobi so wewe ukamwambia unazuka hebu fungua tena umamwambia unazuka kuja because niko makutu mbaya haya daisy akasema imekataa haka kazi ni kuweka tu mama hizi ma, mavitu za huku nyuma haya daisy akasema I'll be coming back in the next three hours. Acha ni freshen up, nikupackageie mali vizuri. Aka ukamwambia unajua venye nitaigonga, you will not believe it. My god. Alafu aka Daisy akajibu akasema and make sure she does she does not ever find out because manze tumetoka fana na yeye. Daisy Daisy my best friend Daisy my friend when you can see I want to go Abu to to go there a bit longer 
because sasa hata there is no need kuendelea ni kama you are doing it uh, with other people and i don't feel like it's my fair to anyone friend well uh. my best friend so angels i think nitaikata at that tuone how what we can do sinda ama wewe kuna my best friend hai usimpige mimi nitampiga leo Shukuru Mungu mimi sio ukambani mimi ningekuroga. So huyo huyo Daisy ana anaishi wapi? Na mnajoana mmesema mlikuwa shule pamoja. Tulikuwa shule pamoja na Daisy. Mm. Daisy anaishi hapa wetaithie. Mm. Na ni beshte yangu na wanajuara niliwa introduce but mimi sikudhani itaenda up hivi. Okay. So I'm sure you, you will have to take that up with him juu what is going to happen because you have not yeah. been faithful to your partner. And it's so wrong. That's been it from me Angels. Mniambia what we are thinking and as always giving up should never be an option. Bye.